Water should be bubbling up out of this hydrant in a suburb of Dusseldorf, but it's not, at least not yet. Without enough water from the mains, these men might have to abandon their project. The problem is that the flow rate might not be adequate. It does happen sometimes. Either the hydrants are clogged or the pressure in the pipes is too low. But then the water comes gushing out after all. It's needed to operate a new kind of drill for installing a geothermal heating system. Although the idea of tapping heat in the ground is old, the technology for assessing it is brand new. Called geojetting, it uses a powerful jet of water to bore a channel through soil and rock. The good thing about this technique is that drilling goes faster and the high pressure water jet cuts through rock as well. That enables us to install our probes securely. They're going to install three geothermal probes under this garden at a depth of 50 meters. The property owner had his doubts, but the advantages of this new drilling technique convinced him. Until now, lots of boreholes were needed, and it was an expensive and time-consuming business. The high-pressure water drilling method cuts costs by about a quarter to approximately 15,000 euros. One advantage, the drilling apparatus doesn't have to be moved around. There isn't much space, and if you need to drill three or four holes far enough apart, that wouldn't work. But with this technique, you can drill at an angle in various directions from one spot on the surface. It's also quicker and cheaper, and that's why I decided to go for it. This new technology was developed by Volker Wittig and his colleagues in a university research project. They spent four years developing this drilling system and own the patent. They went on to found a company with Weiland, a heating systems manufacturer. The new firm is called Weiland Geosysteme. We'd reached the point where it was clear we were moving from research to production and application. So we looked for the right partner in industry with whom we could bring it to market. We did not want our idea to gather dust on a shelf somewhere. For Weiland, it made perfect sense to join in the project. The company makes heating pumps, an integral part of such systems. The market is growing by 10% a year. Starting in 2009, new buildings in Germany will be required by law to partly use renewable energy. The company expects this will boost sales of these new natural heating systems. We believe we can reduce costs in the long term. The innovative new technique is cleaner and requires less space. That's why we were keen to secure access to it early on. And it helps us to market our heating pumps. We can offer complete packages, which brings advantages to homeowners other firms cannot offer. Homeowner Gregor Busmann is spending three times the amount a new oil-fired central heating system would cost, but the investment should have paid off within five years. I reckon I can save 1,000 or 1,500 euros a year in energy costs. And if energy prices continue to rise, the savings will also increase. Another three days of geojetting, and within the week, Busman's home will be warmed with heat from below the Earth's surface. And so he has just cancelled his heating oil order for the winter. And for more about geothermal energy, you can go to the website of Germany's leading financial daily, the Handelsblatt, or you can click on to our very own website. You see it right there. That's dwworld.de. Well, let's pull.